Tappy says, hi. Look, Tappy, that's you. That's Grandpa. Say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> I guess I'm being too loud for him. <laughs> oh, I bored him, apparently. Do I believe, Tappy? Welcome to day 18. Today is Advent Day. Today I'm feeling pretty good. <laughs> I stayed up late last night editing my video and I fell asleep in the process. I woke up about 5 in the morning and I was like, shucks. So from 5 to 6.30, I was, I was clicking and adding videos and texts and I stressed out so much. My thumb went out. So now, while we were waiting for it to upload, I was talking to Jackie, I was talking to Don Rick, I was talking to Sissy, and I talked to a few other people regarding my RA. They were so excited, like, oh my god, zebra pie, zebra pie. Day 18, Southern Skeins. This is called Fig Pudding. Fig Pudding. I think it's Fig Pudding. If I'm wrong, I'll write it in here. Holy smoly, rosy rose ice crochet. Look at this, it's tonal. <laughs> I'll never forget that word and I'm sure you guys won't either. <laughs> it's beautiful, it's a beautiful deep, deep um, violet. It's a beautiful deep tonal violet. Thank you so much, that's day 18 fig pudding. Southern Skein. This is my first advent that I've ever had in my lifetime. I didn't even know they existed until last year. I was deep heart smack in the forest of rheumatoid arthritis, depression, no job, no income, no friends. Um, COVID was hitting. I was a hot mess. <laughs> I was in my room. I was in my room for days, like like days. I wouldn't shower. I probably shower once every 2 weeks. I I was in a bad bad place. But I found you guys and I found an advent and I found there's many many people who are suffering going through the same crap that I am and they told me what they do and this helps them and that helps them and I was like let me give it a try I'm just glad that I'm not alone 18 this is the youtubers advent that my friend Kara sent me hello Kara this is day 18 I love that she individually wrapped each gift that makes me so happy so so happy Yarn. Oh, look at the little Ziploc. <gasps> this must be fancy yarn. I've never seen a little tiny Ziploc like this. Oh, let me see. Let me see. I need my, I need my eyes. Art Knock. My Netting Yarn. 50 grams made in China. Official Moisture Regain 15%. I don't know what that means. It's like a fingering weight. It's so soft. So, so soft. <gasps> Look at that. It's a beautiful, gorgeous orange. Thank you, Kara. Thank you, thank you. Yesterday, I was watching Kalisha from Quirky Monday Craft Cast. Hi, Kalisha. <laughs> and she is doing uh, Grinchmas Vlogmas. And there was one where she said that she's doing Auntie Sissy's uh, slippers. And I think they're slippers for her mom or her auntie. She's trying to recreate them for a family member. And she said that 
it was an easy way she you know she looked at it from a picture and she was able to recreate it no problem so I was like man I've been wanting to make those it's one two three four I think it's just four granny squares and the way you put them together you get a little boot well I started doing that and my hand was like no 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 so I went looking for easy crochet slippers and I found one using a an L hook and it's make and do crew by Jess and it's a, like a 15 minute video tutorial I'll link it below it is from Michaels I use this yarn that my Thelma Lou from Hobby Lobby it's called Nova Scotian Sky she made me a beanie with this and I got me some blue cotton. I don't know what it is because it was frogged and it was a big giant ball. So I don't know who makes it. I'm guessing like lily sugar and cream or something. I combined them to get a chunky weight. I used the L hook. And I made a slipper. I have big feet. <laughs> It looks like a ski, eh? <laughs> it is a hair too big right here because this is, you basically crochet a triangle and then you fold it, you know, you crochet a triangle, you go back and forth so many rows and then you bring it in and you stitch here and you sit, you cinch it a certain way and then the back end you whip stitch and there's your slipper. The difference, I did something different. I went around with half double crochet twice and I closed it up a little bit more because it was down here. And I'll enclose a picture of how it looks on my feet. It is very comfortable. It is done in back loop, back loop only. I like it. It works. Now I just got to make the second one. So I got a hoe. <laughs> and that was all. I'm trying to get back to using my G hook because my fingers are still not able to hold a little tiny thing. But a bigger hook, it was old tape. So that's what I have going on. What are you guys working on? You working on anything? Emily used to like, let me see. Do I see? Oh, what is that? Oh, girl, you need to put some clothes on. You just got out of the shower. Nobody trying to look at your goodies? <laughs> put your clothes on. <laughs> Don't touch yarn like that. Let's see, what do you have over here? Uh, oh, that's pretty. What is that, red and green? Oh, Christmas? Oh, you got Christmas things going on? What do you have? Oh, you put black? You put some black stuff in there? I see orange. What is that? Orange and green? It's like a Halloween Christmas? And you in the back. Let me see. It's a blue. Blue and white. Oh, that's going to be pretty. I can see. You know, I can see. There's. I had that special format thing going on. Look at all these beautiful, oh my gosh, look at, I can see all, I can see you guys like, look, see, I got it, look. I can see all the beautiful colors. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's going to look so beautiful. I can't believe it. All, look, all those colors. I really like that bright colored one over there. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to let you go. Thank you so much for inspiring me, for lifting my, I see you. <laughs> You're not too late. I caught you. I see you. I see you over there. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you for the emails and the comments and the DMs. Thank you for keeping my spirits up. You guys are wonderful. <sighs> I am really thankful that I found this community. Really, really thankful. <laughs> There's a lot of us who this is our only outlet. This is the only way we can show off our projects and you guys are like oh my god i want to make that how'd you do it and you guys are just as excited as we are so yee! 
Thank you so much. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and thank you for watching, and I love you very much. back from walking teeny tiny bebop over there made me some hot cocoa with the unicorn sprinkles that Kara gave me for my advent bon provecho I put some whipped cream and some cinnamon and sugar I wanted to show you something before I finish. So I got all the cakes because I'm on I'm on day five, the gold one, yeah? I got boxes six through eighteen of the Southern Skeins Advent. So instead of balling each one up, I decided to put it on my Swift and I got cakes six through eighteen. Whoopsha! Isn't this genius? That's the bottom. The bottom is wonky. You never want to look at the bottom. You want to admire the top. I'll also enclose a picture. This is day 18. What did I say, Velma? Fig pudding or plum pudding? I can't remember, but I know I said it wrong. I'll put it at the bottom. <laughs> so isn't that beautiful? All the colors are in there. And all I have to do is pull from the middle, and this is day six. And then day seven and day eight, all the way up to day 18. It's all attached together. Oh, that is a load off my mind because I was really stressing on winding the balls when my hands don't work. Now, since I'm coming up to the part where it's just one row repeat instead of the four row repeat, I'm gonna be good. Good and dandy. Do a little bit more of crocheting before another body part goes out. I got some more of my chocolate chip cookies. I keep them in this box. Oh my gosh. Why do they make these so hard, huh? delicious the extra extra chocolate chips so thank you again for watching for liking subscribing for sharing and I will see you tomorrow Arrivederci Amore Say